Right, question number 9. Block A and B of masses 3.5 and 2 kg are connected with a, with a light string across a smooth pulley. At t equal to 0 seconds, block A is pulled by a 30 Newton force. The coefficient of friction between block A and the table, this table is 0.2. Calculate the acceleration as well as the time taken by block B to move upwards by 1 meter. Okay, so now um, the information that we have is um, MA is equal to 3.5 kilogram, MB is equal to 2 kilogram. And then at T is equal to 0 seconds, the force, the 30 Newton force, pulled the pulled block A, and then we have coefficient of kinetic friction of 0.2. Uh, so that is all the information that we have. Now let's draw a free body diagram. This is to help us find the acceleration. Not help us. Wajib untuk kita buat. Okay. Right. So now. Um, okay. No inclined plane. We can just straight away draw the forces. So this is block A. There's weight. There's tension and there's normal force and then there's an external force this is okay so any other friction so there's an additional force there um wait so the force is being the force is pulled that way so acceleration is going here this is A and this is A here okay so the direction of the frictional force should be here lah. okay and then for block B it is this one weight and then tension okay so let's continue this is M A G tension and then kinetic friction force and then what else we have newton and newton pula normal force this is the force plus two this one is so this is 30 degree lah. okay so 30 degree okay <clears throat> okay and then what this is uh, M B G. This is the tension. Okay, so that is our free body diagram. <sighs> okay, now let's do finding the acceleration of both blocks. Okay, so remember anything that follows the forces that follows the direction of the acceleration will be positive. Okay, so positive. Alright, now let's do this. So for block A, for block A, let's look at the total force at the X component which equal to MAA. Okay, so the force is positive cos 30 degree minus FK minus T equal to 0. Equal to 0 okay so, and then f cos 30 degree minus mu k n minus t equal to zero now we have to find the y component juga because we do not have the value of n okay so because of that we have to also find the y component untuk this block okay so let me just uh no I, okay so let's just try and do y through zero so n minus m a g plus f sine 30 degree equal to zero a hey, syllab this is not zero this one m a a m a a and then we have the n here equal to m a g minus f 
sine 30 degree okay so this is equation one this is equation two and then we can look at the block b pula so block b is total force at y equal to m b a okay so this one t is minus t minus m b g equal to m b a then we have the tension to be equal to m b a plus m b g okay so now okay three so now we can substitute two into one dulu <coughs> so f cos 30 degree minus mu k mu k n is m a m a g minus f sine 30 degree and then minus t equal to m a a now this one pula kita perlu substitute 3 into 4 sebab we don't have the tension yet so f cos 30 degree minus mu k f m a g minus f sine 30 degree minus m b m b a plus m b g equal to m a a okay so now let's try and rearrange this because i think the answer scheme missed out something oh no okay it's correct okay okay now uh, so you just rearrange and substitute lah the values okay then you will get you will get the acceleration to be equal to 0.45 meter per second square okay okay then you can find the tension by substituting a into equation 2 ataupun equation 3 tadi tu equation 3 i think yes Eh, sorry, I thought it was asking about the tension. No, it was asking us to find the time taken to by block B to move upwards by 1 meter. Okay, so again, this one is a combination of chapter 2. So, we will be using SUT plus half AT square. Okay, so S dia is equal to 1 meter lah. Sebab dia mau move upwards by 1 meter. So, that's why they're positive juga. And then, it starts from rest. So, 0 plus half acceleration is the one that we've calculated t square so rearrange you'll then get t to be equal to 2.1 seconds okay so that is on question number nine